しいユズミハあんたと同業の忍者だ私を守るん<笑> I just love how the detail they are <laughs> she saw the gear like how, how bubbly they are yeah I didn't get for all she steps inside of his uh, introduction and removes his, his Man, this is crazy Ninta, I see <laughs> She's like, you will fuck me. <laughs> love this She's like, you will sleep with me. You cannot not deny me. I'm a hot Kunichi. You're gonna do it with me. So, uh, the Orion died. <laughs> so, hello, Rob. Of course, I'm Hell's Paradise. Uh, less episodes creation. I don't think this wife will die now. Very unlikely, does the Kunuchi die right? Because, I mean, let's be honest, right? I, I'm Amy only, but I've seen the trailers, I've seen her do stuff that isn't in the episode yet, right? So, uh, she has to be alive, it could be a Kavarami, it could be some kind of illusion, right? She's a ninja, so she probably has some kind of illusion, right? Uh, the Orian, I guess, died? I haven't seen much about her, right? The, you know, the waifu, the hot waifu, but she also might have illusion magic, because she's like a charmer. Uh, Regardless, yeah, this enemy is crazy, right? It feels like uh, everyone dies or something. It's crazy. It's just like, what can I say, right? It, you you really don't know what's gonna happen. It feels like hell is better royal, and then Dalsim also died or something. Yeah, you're like, what? Half the character died in the first things that happened. They just all just bloodbed. Let's watch this episode. See who survives. In three, two, one, and go. I think the samurai guy that cuts his own hand off, that was cool. I guess correctly it was happened, yeah, he's seen the first minute here. He's probably gonna be one of the more sentry characters. He seemed to be pretty hardcore, right? Like, he immediately figured out that he was poisoned, like, I guess he was gonna be by the, the thing. So he's, I feel he's gonna survive this thing. Or I mean, you know, he's gonna live longer, yeah. I feel, I feel he's like a hardcore, intelligent samurai. I feel he's gonna survive a long time. Uh, <laughs> what if I'm wrong and he dies this episode? What if I'm wrong now and he dies in the next scene? I'm just like, I feel pretty confident that the samurai is gonna, you know, he's gonna survive these uh, first uh, weeks here. And now he dies immediately, now he gets hit, hit, flies next next scene. No, but I think that he's gonna, yeah, see? See, this guy is badass, man. Yeah, see, he, he's like the super samurai guy. Seems quite uh, cunning and so on, yeah. He's, he's gonna be one of the winners, or winners, but survivors, I think. Yeah, so we saw him last episode, right? Cutting off his own hand. Um, that was badass. Yeah, he knew that this was... Uh... But, as I guessed correctly, right? Yeah, it was kind of obvious that the insects were gonna poison them. Hmm. Oh, he got two swords with him, that's true. Yeah, his uh, retainer got two swords right there, but one of them looked more like a... And also kunai there too, yeah, on his belt, I guess. Hmm. I don't know. He looks like a ninja guy, yeah. Two shorter broader blades and kunais. He might be like a ninja. So I guess I guess. Narrator guy, you know. Oh, here he is. He's like a doctor or something with the kunais. Yeah, he's like a crazy guy, he's like, I guess. <laughs> Everyone is anime is crazy. Everyone is anime is like a bloodthirsty. Ah, oh, I see. That's why I was wondering why it's some weird. Um, his, yeah, his sword was bent. I was, just, I was wondering. Yeah, I was wondering why his sword was so weird because they were clearly too tiny for his. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Okay, his uh, his he's got the curved blades. I was, just, they were say, they were saying it. Yeah, it didn't make any sense. His sword was kind of weird. Like shorter broadsword. No, yeah, it's okay. There we go. The curled. But this is probably used before, I guess, he got uh, um, bitten by the butterfly. Yeah, probably. See? This guy is like the insects on his island seems pretty bad. Yeah, he, he seems like, you know, you're gonna do the. <laughs> the it's called the curve key, but just the chopsticks. Yeah, you're gonna do the chopstick thing. Oh, I see. Ah, it's like a scorpion. Well, I guess he's an expert, I guess. He's a lot of skates on this field there. This is probably what happens. This is the last episode. Yeah, this is definitely the scene. This is when he walked in and saw the statue. There's also this weird statues right on, on, the, on the island. What? I say that? This anime is so freaky! And suddenly it's like a giant Buddha or something up here. What is that thing? 
And here comes the insects. But what was that thing? What's the purple giant thing? These are even so Ah, oh, the fish! <laughs> this enemy is so weird! And suddenly it's like a walking fish man or something? Nope. Suddenly it's like a giant purple thing coming up in the background. Because we saw last episode he's beaten by the he got beaten right by the butter free and he's he cuts off his hand. But we didn't see the giant purple uh, statue or something. It was like a Buddha or something coming up there. Die Buddha or something, yeah. And then it's like a fish man and walking or something. Well, okay, everything on this island is kinda wacky. Um yeah, there's the audio and dialogue, I guess, notes in there. I guess it's a nice man. Yeah. <laughs> the of it is like... The opening is very freaky, right? We kind of feel that, you know, yeah, the opening it, uh, kind of fits thing. Like this in here, right? The weird, weird, yeah. You know what? That's probably the statue next to him there, right? In the opening that you saw. I mean, you have a tackle there in the opening. that can be connected to the fish thing you saw. But no, but we see like the samurai guy standing in the opening, right? It's probably the statue behind him there that we see in the that we saw. I guess so. Yeah. Then he got his wife as well. Hmm. So the butterflies. Yeah. Hmm. There is Ninja Girl is again though. I think she's gonna survive though. She's also shown a lot more in the opening, right? She we had a she had a head in her in her face last episode, but I, it's probably a cavalry or something. Yeah, she. Okay, here we go. So it's like a, it's very like religious. So it's like a Buddha fish thing. Look at how it has the prayer beads. Yeah, so he has prayer beads. Right, it's like a monk fish. <laughs> I'm like monkfish. See what I did there? <laughs> yeah, monkfish, monkfish. Yeah, see what I did there on purpose. Never that was this. That 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 joke was yourself, man. Monkfish. Yeah, accidental uh, joke. But what is this thing? It's like a giant fish guy with like four hands and double prayer beads. Maybe it's a monk guy that's been transformed then by. Man, this anime is weird, man. But maybe it's like a monk guy that's been transformed. You know what I mean? That's where you get the prayer beads. Like it was like a, a monk that got uh, affected by the monsters or something. And that's why it looks like a religious person or something. Oh, no, it has some. Well, it has now. Get him with some kind of tentacles. What? Well, we do know he's like immortal, so. Yeah, he could probably heal that, but. I like the music too. It's like a weird, airy music in the background. Maybe we should run away from this thing. <laughs> this enemy is so weird. Wait, no, what? You know they're like titans? <laughs> this enemy is so strange. What's happening? It looks like 10 titans are coming. Man, it's taking like like a titan now. What's happening? There's more of them. It's like, what the fuck is happening? What is happening in this anime? What is happening? Suddenly it's like a bunch of titans or something. Oh, it's gonna use its fire ability here on it. Well, it's a fish though, so it's, maybe it's weak against heat. Maybe that makes sense. Because he's gonna punch it. Oh, well, no, he punched the titan guy? That it's like a titan with two of those uh, talismans. He's our Levi. That guy is like an Uni or something. He got like the prayer beats with the club. He got like, the Cabadon. Or a Cabadon. <laughs> yeah, Cabadon, yeah. Kaneba, I mean. Um, they all got like prayer beats though, so it's very kind of religious thing. Man, it's so weird. He's jumping around and he's like fighting titans with prayer beats. And she's just standing there watching all the f butterflies or something. I don't know. She doesn't do much. No, it's just a bunch of blood everywhere. <laughs> yeah, she's just like, oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> but this is like some new Levi thing, man. He's our new Levi. He has around like five million titans. Oh, yeah, because there's weird insects everywhere. And she's gonna die here from Kofi Saber. But probably. Yeah, she fight this like Dalsim, Dalsim titan. Yeah, with like the weird. He's gonna he's feel so fresh with her, right? You know, his wife who. It made her be, be, become friends that episode. Yeah, she's gonna save her because they're friends now. 
Yeah. Oh, nice. Saves her and even like yeah, gets her in an arm. And she's all like, oh, Gabby Mara! She's all like, Gabby Mara, you saved me! <laughs> oh, what? Who's that? Ah, oh, it's the Nina lady! Yeah, she's alive somehow because she definitely didn't die. We saw her, she's like, so going, guys! So going, so going! And she's the sexy Nina lady. She's all like, hey! <laughs> See, she's clearly the best uh, woman. Yeah, hey, guys! Yeah, be friends with everyone now. Remember friendship now, friendship. He's like, let's be team up or something with the Nina girl, yeah. Yeah, thank you! <laughs> arigato! <laughs> He's all like, arigato, arigato! Gonna be nice to her. She got a very revealing cleavage, I like that. Yeah, her eyes are quite... But I mean, um, yeah, she didn't die in this episode. Well, as I mentioned earlier, I mean, we knew that. She was in the trailer and so on. So yeah, she wasn't gonna die. What's her power then? Well, she's a badass ninja lady. Very seductive ninja lady. She means like, wanna be my husband? Yeah. A very married lady. It means that she's like, let's do it. Okay, so. She's there. Doesn't work with Gabmara, man. Hey, <laughs> Tai! Doesn't work on him. Doesn't work on him at all. He's very lovely wife. I like how her butt cheeks were. <laughs> very detailed. <laughs> yeah, it was very. It was a good map. I was like, gonna draw this butt cheeks there. Yeah. Someone was like, okay, this gift this is gonna be a good gift for man with her butt cheeks that's standing up there. Yeah, why are you three people of you? Oh, well, I killed this guy, so. Oh, he got a Kusurifundo ass. Kusurifundo ass. Like a chains there. Yeah, I had that guy, but he died. <laughs> oh, he fell for the boobs, yeah. He couldn't fight the boobs, no, yeah, he... <laughs> the boat is like, yeah, okay, sure. Naruhodo, Naruhodo! <laughs> he couldn't, uh, yeah, Ninja, Ninja boobies were too powerful, yeah, it's like, yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Man, this woman though, she, oh, she interrupted, interrupted, she she went over his like narrative box there in her breast. Yeah, she can, uh, she walked in with her breast in front of the narrative box so couldn't see his name. Man, this anime, that was a good forward wall. Yeah, you know, you popped up like a, a tag, you know, oh, I am this guy, and her breasts are like, no, covering over, shut up, loser. Yeah, it's like, it's all about me, man. Yeah, I love it. But look at seriously how much they're spending time on her, like, her, like, bumping, yeah, her ass is really, like, moving, man, yeah, literally. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, this ninja woman, she takes no, not, this ninja, this ninja lady doesn't take no for an answer. She's just like, oh, let's do it. <laughs> yeah, she's just like, oh, you are gonna, uh, you're gonna sleep with me, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, owner guy! Please be my boyfriend though! She's crazy, man. Oh, I love it, yeah. <laughs> she used to have what's called like Nintai usually. Yeah, Nintai. Not uh, Hentai. Nintai. The whirlpool technique. Yeah, when I trained, uh, I believe it's called Nintai, right? It's like the whirlpool kick kind of things. Um, can I pull him down? Yeah, you got kick when you sat up and you kick upwards. That. I believe that's what it's called. Nintai. I think so. Nin. Yeah, I think so. Uh, so you can find something. Ah, uh, something like that. I think that's what it's called. That, 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 that school of techniques. Yeah, so kind of like that. Okay, so just tied him up. She's a very friendly ninja lady. Yeah, very, very friendly. Very, very wholesome ninja lady. Oh, I killed him. It was awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's like... Yeah, and then she pretended to die here, yeah. That's a great strategy. Yeah, a great strategy. Ah, oh, this got books there with the more. He got a book there showing the Titan thing. But there is still this weird statue, so they're like humans then, that just form into statues, and then... Yeah, like why why is so many statues of these weird uh, Titans? So, um... 
I guess so. Hmm. It explains how it has so many weird statues. But I'm sure you're gonna team up with her for a while at least. It feels like she is somewhat of a conniving ninja chick, so you know you can totally team up with her for a bit at least. She probably won't betray them for now. Her cleavage though is quite betraying her up, I saw. Very nice. Oh, Imoto? She got a little sister at home to protect. <laughs> I just like this. Yeah, this is my turn into a ninja girl! <laughs> I love her, man. This is my turn into a badass ninja chick uh, to protect my Imoto. It might all be a lie, though. Yeah, this is a ninja seductor, though. It might all be a lie, though. It might all be a complete fake lie, but uh, he's like, that's why I became a Konuchi for my Imoto. I was like, sure you did. Sure you did. Sure, sure. I trust that. And I like the boob monster. <laughs> it's very deep, this woman. Yeah, they spent a lot of time on like her, her ass cheeks bunching as well. Yeah, so it's <laughs> a lot of time on like. Making your up eyes and uh, <laughs> spooky. It's a lot of like bounce effects. Yeah, it's very very detailed there. Uh, it's been half the budget in this thing. Now we're gonna trigger her. Yeah, how did you pull out the sword on your body? Oh, you know, it was my uh, technique. Yeah. Man, she's evil, man. Yeah, here we go. I got her evil face. Yatta, indeed. Let's be. <laughs> but I love it bounce better. But look at her ass on bouncing it is. Yeah. I love how detailed to make her butt cheeks move, man. I gotta, I gotta gift it later. I gotta gift it later. I gotta gift that uh, the cheek later, man. It's very good how the detail there uh, making the cheeks be. Yeah, it's so so. I would never lie. <laughs> She's so evil, man. You so obviously I want to manipulate your evil woman. Yeah, it's like, yeah. Yeah, I would never lie to you. I got me my room, I'm your new wife. But she's clearly being poisoned by some gas or something. Yeah, she's falling down there. Uh, she collapses there. Yeah, definitely. Hmm. Okay, I guess she's dreaming a little bit, I guess her backstory here, I think so. Probably when she was younger though. No, it's the older guy, ah, it's the guy that beat Dalsim. I see. It's his backstory, when he was in... Yeah, he's an aggressive guy, you know, the, br the brutish... He kind of... Uh, Comes off as the brute, right? You know, the aggressive guy that bites people and f throws them on crazy so on. I don't know. What's her his powers? Like, he's just brutality? He's violent? Something like that? I, I think so. He's just like... He probably has some power, but it feels like he's mostly a violent, crazy guy. Yeah, he comes in here like, yeah, let's fight. Right? Well, yeah, so we did see this episode, how he beat Dalsim, and then they left. Oh, no, they're gonna fight more Titans. Okay, yeah, he's gonna fight Titans. Well, of course, he's gonna beat the, beat the Vampires. <laughs> he's like, yeah! Nissan! <laughs> he just likes it. He's like, that's my Nissan! He's just like, yay! He's just happy seeing him like destroy them. He's like, yeah! Awesome! <laughs> Like, that's my. But they probably won't betray each other at all. Yeah, I mean, you see clearly some in conflict between the retainer and uh, the crazy, you know, royal guys. Yeah. But these two probably are the most, like, you know, probably the most, like I said, actually like a, a pair that want to kill each other in that sense. Yeah, probably not. Okay. And that's gonna be his boyfriend, I guess. Or something. Exactly. You run away. Oh, he's blinded by. That's true. Yeah, he's blinded his right eye, right? 
<laughs> but I like I like that he, he's like happy that he's. Uh... <laughs> but they, yeah, again, these these two are actually the, probably the best pair, right? They, they actually are. Yeah, they're actually all teaming up and they're actually friends. They're brothers. They actually like each other. <laughs> no, but seriously, everyone else is like, I will kill you when you sleep, right? These two are the only one being like, actually, I like you. Yeah, like we we will hopefully never betray each other. Maybe. No, okay, then he leaves him. Damn it, just when I said that, I was like, wait, is he gonna leave him? But he did kind of stand up to him, wait, say him earlier? How? Well, actually, maybe he always left me behind. What? <laughs> when he left, he was always like this. Or something. Okay, now it's Epsom Adam. Okay, yeah, of course. He's got, he's got a bigger sword, or axe rather, sword axe, yeah. He's got a bigger weapon. <laughs> okay. I would never let you die. I just needed a bigger weapon. Like, uh, that threw cure dice. I just needed, uh, you know, something stronger. Oh, was that? He probably got a chain or something. Oh, he can shoot chains or something? He can talk even. This thing just gets weirder and... Oh, <laughs> that was like a bug. This thing just gets weirder and weirder every time. Oh, it's another Buddha fish guy. The two of them. But I guess the guy was shooting like a shade through his hand or something. Yeah, like, uh, man, these Titans just get weirder and weirder, man. What? And there's a bunch of heads. And there's like an old movie. But I guess he's, he's gonna get pissed off and get stronger. <laughs> oh my god, this anime is crazy. But he really has been Titan now. Yeah, this guy's jumping around with a giant hatchet and like killing Titans. My god, it's so bloody. This is Tiger Titan, man. This is a new Tiger Titan, seriously. Yeah, I will be God. <laughs> I'm God! <laughs> yeah, he's like, he's, that, he's like, that's my brother! <laughs> he's like, yeah, that's right. Yes! He stands here like, screaming at it. What? Oh. Hmm. Yeah, you never try again, weakling. Yeah, but I'm your big bro! Probably die soon. Yeah, he probably dies now. He will probably die the next thing there, because the M is crazy. <laughs> There's so many bloods that way. So many, so many bodies! This is so many bodies! He's like lying, he's lying on the bodies there. Man, I like his weapon, he's like big as his whole body, he's very anime. He's like, I got an axe, big as my whole body, yeah, it's like, it's big, my whole upper body, yeah, it's like, great, great, man. It carries my whole body weight. Yeah, it's like, nice. <laughs> he has to carry her. <laughs> This is what do it himself, Gamari. Like, you carry her, woman. <laughs> yeah. This is like, you will sleep with me! <laughs> man, this ninja chick is crazy. I love her, man. Yeah, Kunuchi Cray Cray, man. She's like, you and me will do it. Um, but yeah, she keeps trying to seduce him. And he's like, no, I love my wife. He's like, I am one woman. Uh, but I really love the scene before, uh, before this, right? It was so ridiculous when he hold her in the typical um, uh, joint lock stance. And we see her butt cheeks like <laughs> wiggling. Yeah, it was so detailed. Why was her ass like? Do -do 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 -do. I was like, okay, they put like a lot of effect, like, a bounce effect there. Yeah, I was like, well, what's happening? Um, and also, one see that she was doing her thing with her, her breasts was like, burp, burp, burp. Uh, very, very detailed, right? Uh, but otherwise, of course, um, the anime really, really must take Titan. 
uh, from a premise standpoint, I guess, vicious standpoint, right? They're fighting this huge, like, Buddhistic... Yeah, it's like uh, Buddha to Titan, right? Everyone is like a Zen monk or something. Man, all, all of them have, like, prayer beads, right? And the guy has, like, his, has the prayer bead. He's holding his hands, you know, this positioning, and he's, like, praying and so on. Yeah, so they're... But he had, like, more hands. So one, two of his hands, like, praying and all that kind of fighting and so on. So feels like some kind of weird, like, uh, Buddhistic Attack on Titan, yeah. I mean, Gabbar was jumping around owning them. It really did feel like watching Levi, you know, it's like jumping and cutting their heads off. Yeah, it's like, man, yeah, this is Levi, man. Uh, <laughs> this is really going into Take a Titan now, yeah. Buddhist Take a Titan, certainly. Um, Ninja Six, she's fun, man. Clearly the best character in the anime, yeah. Ninja Waifu, uh, hilarious character. And of course, she was just part of her ploy, right, to pretend she was dead and so on. Uh, and I guess picked up uh, the guy she kills, uh, you know, his uh, retainer basically. I just picked him up too. Um, and then we see that the two other or uh, siblings, yeah, Kuwa dies. Uh, so, like I said, in the end, right, those two guys are probably the best pair, right? At least not from a power level, but from a trust level, right? Which might be really important because, I mean, this thing here seems kind of un unreliable, right? That she won't betray you eventually. And as we've seen, right, a lot of these. Um, yeah, they, 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 will, they will kill each other, right? Uh, but I guess the brothers are like the most, uh, like, we are a team, right? So they're probably the best teams. And then the samurai guy, we saw him a little bit, right? Uh, I remember his name um, in the beginning, his flashback. Uh, then we kind of used to went back to him having beaten the guy, uh, the titan he faced in the beginning. So you can ask him over him after his flashback there. But he seemed, he seemed to me like one of the guys who I lead the longest. I said earlier, right? Because he seems very like cunning, very smart, very like I understand what's happening here. He seems to be quite like, you know, getting it, so to speak, right? So he's probably gonna survive for a long time. Even though he lost an arm in the beginning though, but I think he's gonna like you know, that's gonna be his like loose and then probably live the longest or one of the probably this. Uh but anyway guys, thanks for you, subscribe, slap it right, stay with one piece, made tonight, right? Launching out the uh, heavenly delusion. The anime is crazy. That was, oh my god, that is so crazy. I was spoiled here, of course, but Heavy Delusion is very weird. Very, very strange. It has like a really weird R scene in this episode, and it's very, very gender bender. And it's, it's just because every episode it gets weirder and weirder than anime. So Saturday has really become anime weirdness. Yeah, this is like Attack on Titan on Beauty's time, right? And then the other thing is like, oh, it's just really weird. It's very hentai. It's very, very strange. Uh, but I think it's have a great day.